Uh, good afternoon, Gringo, or Racial of South Texas Border Sports. Uh, it's been a difficult moment for the club thus far in this early part of the season. For you uh, being one of the leaders of the team, just what do you tell the squad right now as it's trying to just uh, recover that uh, hurt pride that it took on Saturday night and try to uh, take the show on the road and try to uh, get, turn turn the fortunes around a little bit. Hello, how you doing today? Good. Um, we've been in this situation already. We uh, I'm glad it happened. It happened right now, and not at the end of the season. Um, we know we we had a real bad game. It's been a while since the team came over and and played us the way they played us. We really didn't even get our hands on the ball, but um. Like I said, I'm glad it happened right now. We've talked over it. The guys have great mentality. We know we've been through this road uh, once already, but we know we have the the quality to get this team out of this hole. And hopefully uh, we can do it this weekend. We know it's going to be a tough game, but we got the the guys, the right guys to to pull this team together and the right mentality. Absolutely, and you you know to, you talk about the mentality and the in the mental strength of this team that it's been through this situation before. But for the newer guys that haven't been through this situation, just how do you get them uh, connected and bridged together, er, so that everyone's on that same page? Well, if you know the guys that that came in, the newer guys, they've been in the league for a while. The only thing that we can tell is the younger guys. You know, um, Luna, Sordo, Dylan. Uh, those guys, you know, they don't need to play with pressure. Leave the pressure to the older guys, like in my case, Puma, Juan David, Tyler, uh, Francois. You know, leave the pressure to us. Uh, those guys just need to go out, enjoy the game because they're they're just starting now their career. So we don't want to pressure those guys and and for them to have all that on their shoulders. So um, it it's up to the older guys to pull this team together. And we're doing it. We're doing it right now. So we know it's a long season. It's a very, very long season. And we're going to face this the right way. So this weekend we have another final. And from now on, we're going to play every game like a final. And you're going to see a whole different team this weekend. Thank you. Shadow. Go ahead, Shadow. Good evening, Mr. Torres from Germany. I have a, a bit of similar question to raise because he asked mine in a a better way. Um, there was a scene, I believe, at Oakland or the first game at Monterey, where you took the three kick, which would be maybe our goal. And then you were maybe the last one who had to run from the set piece to our back line to uh, help saving the, the counter attack. And I want to ask you about um, maybe your thoughts about the gaps between the lines and how you can help maybe to um, make the defense more solid and the um, midfield more solid because, yeah, we concede too many goals and of course there were more experienced players like um, Juan David Cabezas, but it looks difficult so far. And if you have to run from the goal of, for example, Monterey to help at our goal as a set piece taker, it looks a bit uh, strange. Um, every game is different. Every game is totally different. I know they're coming off of beating an MLS team, so their confidence is going to be uh, pretty high. But soccer's soccer's a strange sport. You can be in first place, and the last place team can come in and can beat you. So right now, I'm not I'm not too worried about um, facing whatever team you have to face. We have to face them and play like a final because. We're here at home, and it's been a long time since a team came over and beat us the way they beat us, and by three goals. So it was, um, it was a shame. But everybody knows what they have to do. So um, I'm just focused on on the team, on what we can get better. Obviously, we played uh, Memphis a different way than we usually than we usually play. So it didn't work out, and that starts with uh, it starts with us. We we set back. We didn't pressure the way we usually pressure. But like I said, this weekend is going to be a whole totally different team, and you're going to see you're going to see the uh, the heart. You're going to see the desire of the team to go out and play. 
Thanks. You're welcome.